Good morning, everybody, and welcome to the second episode of Running Shorts, where I give you a lot of information in a little bit amount of time. Today's the 10th episode on the channel, and this marks me keeping up with something for 10 whole weeks. But let me tell you something that wow. I kept up with for an entire year. Stay tuned. So today we are running in my neighborhood, but on a different route than usual. We're still in Stanford, Connecticut, but a little bit more of the back roads than we're used to. And let me tell you about something I kept up with for an entire year. So to go back a little bit, every New Year's, starting a probably freshman or sophomore year of high school, I would pick something and keep up with it for an entire year. Other things that I did was I went an entire year without eating any fast food. I went an entire year without eating any bagged chips or cookies, and I've gone an entire year without swearing. All of those could warrant a video of themselves. But the one that I felt was probably the most difficult was when I was in high school, I went an entire year only drinking water. So for some people, this is easier than it is for others, but I was addicted to Arizona iced tea and I loved myself some sugary drinks. So much so that I made an entire song about Arizona iced tea. I would have sugary drinks way more than I would have any any amount of water. I still drank water, but I couldn't imagine an entire week without a sugary drink. But I decided, let's go an entire year without anything but water, as far as drinking. Everyone would ask me, am I eating anything? Yes, but the only drink I'm having is water. So the pros for this, pretty much there's only pros and no cons, are endless. I can tell you that over the course of a year, I lost a bunch of weight. I can tell you right now that I felt a lot better. People say it's better for your skin to have a lot of water, and I could definitely tell that. I felt a lot better, I looked a lot better, and it is cheaper. Going on a just water diet, if you should call it that, means that everywhere you go, your drink will be free. If you're going to any restaurant, it's free. If you're gonna go anywhere to eat, Though it might not be the best, you could just have tap water. And this will save you so much money over the course of a year. This was high school, so I wasn't drinking alcohol. So I didn't save money in that regard. But just a few dollars a week over the course of a year, buying other things besides water, added up for a high school student. It saved me a ton of money. While all my friends were buying a large $4 Coke when they went out, I just had myself some water, please. And that's just a thing. Like I said, water's everywhere. It's not like going on a gluten-free diet where you have to seek out a specific thing. When you're drinking just water, they have that everywhere you go. Now, the thing that made this a little bit easier is that I will put a little asterisk saying that I did add some lemon, natural lemon, to my drinks to give it some flavor. But in high school, this is the time where when you did something, you made a statement out of it. And I remember posting on Facebook, like, I'm just gonna drink water. Let's get 100 likes, things like that. And the first little while when I started, you thought it was gonna be hard, but it really wasn't. It was like waking up after getting no sleep, but you're going on a fun adventure that day. So the adrenaline just keeps you going anyways. And that's sort of what it was like. It really never got hard. The first week, I just didn't wanna fail on everybody. And all the subsequent weeks just became easier because you're already in the habit. So that was an entire year that I went with only drinking water. Though, there was one time I was over his house at which he no longer lives at anymore. Rest in peace that house. And we were just having fun late at night, some type of sleepover. And we're going into his kitchen and he has some type of like new orange juice or I have no idea, mango juice. He's like, yeah, man, it's really late. He's like, yeah, give this a shot. Hey, look, mucho mango. That was his favorite. And he's like, yeah, give this a shot. I'm like, I don't really want to. So I go down, pick up the glass, take a sip, and I, I'm like, oh, I swallow it. I'm like, it was like a realization. I'm like, Tyler, I can't have that. That's it's not water. And that was the one mistake. One thing I forgot about all this was that my brother, Dan, drank a ton of Monster. In fact, he has a tattoo of the Monster logo. He loved it so much. I think he got that afterwards though. And he wanted to try it too. 
and he gave it a great shot. He went pretty long without it, though. He did end up breaking the rules at some point. It's okay. And that was the entire year. There's a picture of everything I bought that January 1st. I went out to like Dollar Tree or Five and Below. It's like everything's a dollar or two. And I buy a slew of drinks, Gatorades, Arizonas, Snapples and all. So that was me for an entire year drinking just water. And I won't bore you within a subsequent year, but a couple years went by. I'm in college. Still, I didn't drink any alcohol. I did when I turned 21 and my senior year was full of it, but it was either my freshman or sophomore year where I decided to do uh, water yet again for an entire year. And it worked out really well. Second time and I think doing this has helped me a lot because now I can just reach for a water and just have it be all that much more easy thinking I've gone years just drinking water. I can save the weekends for sugary drinks, which I typically do now. Though, I've kind of fallen to the knees of coffee. Well, thanks everybody for going on that little jog with me. I know it's a shorter one, but that part of the neighborhood I truthfully enjoy a little bit more than this side. It's a lot more quiet. Well, if you guys want to check out that last video I did right over here, it is chock full of crazy shenanigans and just wild things me and my friend Max were up to 10 years ago. If you want a playlist of other running shorts, this is your video right here. Thanks a lot. If you guys are one of the 13 subscribers, thank you so much for being here. Hope to see you guys in the next video. Peace.